Hello, this is Mr. Baglio, and I wanted to make a quick video for you to show you how to use a template off of Google Docs, make a copy of it, fill in what you need to fill in, and then share it back to me. In this case, we'll be using it to complete the assignment, the bridge test, post-test analysis. So let's begin. First, go to Google and sign into your account. In this case, I'll sign in with not my school email. And you'll sign in with your school email. The only reason I'm not doing it is because I don't want to go to uh, have it be able for me to edit the document. I just want to sign in so it looks like you would see it. Then you go to my web page and go to homework assignments. Under homework assignments, go down to this document right here, post test quiz analysis template, and click on it. As you notice, I can only view this. I can't change it. So what I need to be able to do, because I need to fill this in, is go to File, make a copy, and then name it. Usually you will be given what's called a naming convention that means a conventional way of naming it. The reason behind this is so that the files organize themselves in alphabetical order when I see them in my Google Drive. So in this case I'll put my band, let's pretend I'm in a band, and my last name, my first name, and then the assignment, bridge test post test analysis. Alternating capital letters. Uh, put capital letters where they should be and then lowercase letters. No spaces. Then hit OK. So now I've renamed, copied it and renamed it. So at the top you'll notice there's this red text. This is instructional text. And it says how to use this template. Go to file menu then make a copy and name the new file using this pattern. Okay, just did that. And for example, okay, I, that's exactly what I called it. And after you have done all the steps above, delete this red text and carry on with the assignment. Then share it with your teacher, clicking the blue button in the upper right of this page. Then your teacher's email address in the box that says invite people. Okay, so let's do what it says. Delete the text. Actually, I'll leave the text in case I forget what I'm doing. Go up to the upper right and hit share. I want to share this with Mr. Baglio, the teacher, at the teacher email address. So I go to invite people, jbaglio at, oh, there it is, pops right up. And I click share and save. Green button. And then done. Now I can erase this red text. And put, it's not a quiz, so we'll say post test analysis. And then I will just go and replace the text. My name, John Baglio, band. As I said before, I am pretending I am an A band, so I'll put A here. The date, it's Halloween, so we'll say 10, 31, 15, bridge test. And then I will go and start typing in my responses. I can even make it fancy if I want and change the font as if I'm writing something different in here by handwriting. Okay, and then once it's all done, you don't have to push share or save or anything. If you've already shared, which we just did, any changes I make will automatically show up on the teacher's version of this. So hopefully this was helpful, and now you know how to use a template document and share it on Google Docs. Thanks for watching.